Hello and welcome to Imperion Galactic Survival, a little creative mode scenario thing. We're just going over the Star Salvage stuff basically. It's kind of like a, an aftermath where we look at what we built and all that. I didn't build that, I destroyed that. Uh, yeah, so, and we're going to sort of work on uh, texturing the marmot finally as well. And maybe get one of these or both of these possibly workshop ready. Let's start off the thing that's not going to be on the workshop and that would be uh, this thing here. <laughs> oh, the poor thing took a, a beating, didn't it, during the playthrough. It absolutely got mullered this front section anyway because it's mostly just regular steel blocks around it. At least it's not made of plastic, but it almost might as well have been. Uh, but yeah, it did get, it did get quite, uh, quite beaten up quite bad. Um, I'm quite happy with what I built here. It was it was decent. I thought it was kind of, you know, creative enough. I uh, never got around to texturing some parts of it. But uh, yeah, we were growing the pentaxid in here as well. If only we came across more arrestrum. That's one thing that was troublesome. I like these little bits here where we could stash uh, statues. I don't see any statues right now. Did they all blow up? Oh, I've got the statues there. Oh, I had them all out here. I swear I had some in there. Hmm. Maybe it's my imagination. Uh, but yeah, anyway, the old shield was uh, redundant, so we had to throw a new one in here. So there you go. Uh, right, uh, that's pretty much that. I loved being able to use these turrets, by the way. That was kind of cool. I would like to make some sort of junk CV that would be good for Star Salvage and like have it on the workshop. Might be kind of nice. So maybe I'll build something from scratch, or maybe I will work on this and just actually armor it up properly. So it looks like a sort of junk vessel. And... Uh, you know, kind of fits the theme. I'd maybe change these bits at the back here, make them a bit sleeker, possibly, don't know. But anyway, let's have a little look at, well, we did have a little small vessel, but I decommissioned it to build something bigger, didn't I? Or it got blown up, one of the two, probably blown up. Uh, we've got the Marmot here, which we are going to, it's gonna be the focus of today's video, actually. So first thing I want to do, we need the item menu and those ion blasters. Yeah, we're gonna need, some of these so I'm gonna to need to get rid of like a bunch of this stuff here I just don't even need it I'm gonna need yeah right right hang on doesn't actually matter where I put any of this because it's all you know none of it's none of it's sticking around I'll put this in spare one yeah there we go get rid of you uh, I guess get rid of you you see sniper yeah you can stay down there the flamethrower that just gives me a little bit of room here. Okay, nice. We'll throw the weapons all in here. I shouldn't need them, you see. Right, I want an ion blaster, which is right there. We need a light as well. Okay, great. And I think we're going to need some hardened steel blocks as well. So this is pretty much ready. The thing I'm going to do here is... Get rid of this. Oh, I didn't. I could have just put it here. Right, there we go. I think two was the right amount. It got rid of shields pretty quickly. You could get away with just one. You really could get away with just one. Absolutely. Like, that would work really well. Um, if you need... If you're a little bit more CPU restricted. So if you had one... Yeah, you could probably make a T2 with one ion blaster and then a couple of rockets. A bit of careful flying. You could probably navigate that all right. Right. Uh, is this the right way around? Yeah, that is. Sorry, it just looked a bit weird. Uh, there we go. We've got light on the front there. There you go. Look at that. We'll see that at night time. See how it goes. All right. Now we're going to need to we'll just trash that. I think we obviously want to go for a marmity type color. Brown, I guess. Yeah, oops. Pressing the wrong button. What are we going to do here? What, what, sort, what sort of overall texture? What's, what's marmity? <laughs> Is that even a thing? Like, it, they're kind of like bristly, aren't they? They kind of are. Yeah. That actually would work, I think. But we're going to have to be a little bit more careful with it. So do you know what? Let's go X. No, no, that's not what I'm looking I'm not looking to do. No, I am looking to do a symmetry plane. But not that one. That one, yeah. Huh? Oh, was that the wrong colour? That was weird. Yeah. I am tempted, though, to just go all over first. 
and instead just make sure it's, I don't know, this, how's that? Yeah, I guess this will probably do, for now. Get that base coat in. That's a nice way to do it. It's fine if we lose the bits on the nacelles here, or the little front sections, that's no problem. There we go. It doesn't sound that loud, but whenever I edit these videos, yeah, and I do this texturing with all the large, all these blocks here, it always comes up as massive sound spikes in the audio. It's really weird. Like, it's really, really, like, I have to really do some editing. It's odd, like, visually, but sound wise, it, it sounds completely fine. It's very strange. Okay, that's good. There we go. I'm liking it. Alright, and then we can do individually. Da, 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 da. That should be fine. That should be fine. Great, so we've just got our base... base coat of the marmot here. Uh, right, we're going to go back to small here. And we're going to go with... I do, I do think this was quite a good one. Hmm. I need to do it like this, aren't I? Three, two, three. Just gives it a little, little something extra, I suppose. <laughs> And maybe something interesting in the middle. Like uh, this, possibly. Oh, what's this all about? Hmm? I guess you can have be like that. And maybe, maybe. I was going to say go for something like this. Yeah, I suppose. Not so sure. Uh, at the bottom here, we want to put. I'm thinking something like this. Will do. As for the sides, I don't know. Got to do something here. Like this can be like maybe a dark brown. And be a bit rougher. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's good. That's all right. Uh, oh my gosh, I thought of it. I thought I know exactly what to do here. <laughs> You're gonna like this. You're gonna like this. All right. Uh, we want this one. We want da 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 da. That that is the one we want. Yeah, that's it. Uh, no, that's not it. Actually, yeah, this is probably it. No. Uh, oh, that's not quite what I was thinking of. I want like I want it to be like this. Oh, I was hoping to give it like teeth. It's like this. <laughs> what about that? No, no, don't, don't let me down. There needs to be like, it needs to be teeth like this. Uh, you know what? You can have that anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Go for a slight yellowy because they don't brush their teeth. Uh, nice and. There we go. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, <laughs> it's not, not amazing. Uh, right, there's something interesting I wanted to do here. Right, yes, there was. Yes, there was. I want to do something a little bit more funky. I'm thinking like some sort of computery work. Maybe we go with... Maybe we go with green, maybe we go with red. And then I'm thinking here, uh, something with lights. Bright yellow's a bit, bit bright, a bit much maybe. That's all attached, that's all part of the cockpit here. 
から、カフェ。And I think we do this, and then actually, do you know what?、Uh, no texture. That only. There we go. So it's kind of connected to that, and you know what? You can do something similar to this. Yeah. Hmm, that kind of goes all the way down, though. Cannot see. Oh no, that's fine, though. Oh wait, I'm in the ground. Yeah, that 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 works. I think works enough.、Uh, I want to do some texturing here, so we want kind of like vents. I think. Do you want that? I don't know. I think I maybe want like a little switchy type thing. Where's the sort of one of all the switches? Yeah, possibly this. All right. Now these types of blocks here, right? So this is kind of like this is another one that's got to be a bit interesting. Oof. Actually, do you know what? That does work all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Uh, this way. What about that way? All right, that's not bad. It's not too shabby.、Uh, maybe want to do something a bit more of these. I'm wondering. I do wonder.、Uh, why have you got shields on? Because you're switched on now. That's why. <laughs> okay. Now that the sun's going down, we can start to see the effects of sort of the light. I wonder if you want to put any lights around the side of it, possibly. Also, do you want to change the color of the thrusters? That actually might be a good idea. Should we do that? Maybe the white color, kind of similar to the the toucan, actually. I think that works. Oh, we have to go through all of these. Oh, this is long. Eh. Oh no, that looks no, no, no. Oh god, what has happened there? No. Actually, you know what? Hang on a second. That's fine. That's actually not as bad as I was thinking. Not great. Can't think about it. It is as bad as I was thinking. <laughs> I'm gonna make this just sort of black, and then instead. I wouldn't have mind the out outside of all of this. Just have to hope that shows. Yes, it does. Okay. Do 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 do. There we go. I think I'll have a bit more of a striking impact. That's fine. You can sort of hang out like that. Uh, do we have space here for more thrusters? <gasps> we do. We have more thruster space. We are totally going to utilize that. It just makes sense, right? We want to add as many thrusters. We've got the CPU, so let's do it, shall we? Retrieve. I know I've not been doing this side, but it seems to be working okay. Um, you're actually completely sorted. Okay, great. All right. Excuse me. Okay, thrusters.、Uh, we like the jet thrusters because we get all the little bonuses, little boost bonus from those. All right. Shove them in here. Okay.、It、can be that brown color. That's not quite what I meant, but it's fine. Looks pretty nice.、Uh, got a little bit of a. Yeah, we need to sort that out. Is that it? Just the two? It is just the two. Everything else seems fine. As long as there's nothing clearly visible, 
and I'm happy enough with it. Okay, down thrusters appear to be okay, apart from you. You're the wrong colour. There we go. Alright, let's lift it up a little bit. Alright, there. Very nice. And, oi. There we go. Not as fussed by the underside, you generally don't look at its belly much. <laughs> Let's, uh, I think I might do something interesting here. Let's go with this. Oh wait, wrong thing. There we go. Do that, do that. Still debating this. This has lights. What if instead we made it like like yeah, we did this instead. Don't know. Just it's a it's a bit more interesting, and it's kind of in theme with the colours there. Right, lights back on. Should we get that scruffy looking thing here? I don't know. Yeah, maybe that'll do. And maybe we'll give it like a bit of a belly or something. Uh, textures. No, no texturing. Oh, this is the te- wait, no, this is the texture. What am I doing? No colouring. That's it. That's what we want. Problem is here, I'm going to have to get in all the, uh, I'm getting these. Eh. Okay. I'll never know why it does that, but it does it, nevertheless. See, look, it just is like, nope, gotta go the other way. For some reason. Right, how's this side? Yeah, nope, this side's all, all fine. <laughs> is that... <laughs> yeah, you could <can> stay. <laughs> can I make this look more like a mouth? Maybe? I could do, but uh, that's just uh, that maybe going a bit too far. <laughs> All right, really simple build. I am considering maybe doing something of this section here. Very difficult to use these uh, diagonal blocks because texturing-wise, some of it gets particularly messy. So really, the only way you can do it is, I guess, a little bit of trial and error. So. Like, that looks a bit naff, doesn't it? I mean, it's not the worst thing I've ever seen. But yeah, it only works one way. Oh, hang on, you know what? We might be able to make that work. If we, you know what, hang on, I I, I want to, ah, uh, it won't work like that, will it? Because it works, ah, it just doesn't, doesn't symmetry properly in the same way, you see. That's the problem with it. Maybe you should just do this. That should work all over, right? But then again, same problem. It's just not like, yeah, this is a no. So yeah, some of them work, some of them don't. And this is a hard pass, unfortunately. Uh, all right, anything else? More thrusters would be good. We need to put the things back on as well. The, these. The these. Uh, I think I'm missing a shutter. No, I didn't take one of them off, did I? I think. Alright. Okay. This one, this one, this one, this one. There we go. I need to put the uh, symmetry mode back on, I think. Very good. And what sort of colour? I'm going to match it. I think we'll match it. Alright. More thrusters. So, forward thrusts. Fine. That is, like, really good. Lift. 
We did add a bit more lift, so that was good. Reverse. Do we even have any reverse? Oh, wow, yeah. I've forgotten that that's even a thing. Uh, more reverse would be nice, but that's one of the most difficult ones to sort of squeeze in a design. Uh, that's not good. Do we, do we get it? No. Good. All right, we're going to have, just have to remove these. I'm trying to be, you know, lazy. <laughs> All right, we also need to make sure we kind of get all of this. I should all be on the inside, right? I should have no contact to the outside. All right, very good. Let's configure this like so. Okay, very good. Uh, there's a gap there, though. What can we put here? You're a storage repository. So surely we can just add more storage, right? Yes. That's what this is telling me. Why not? Can I place another controller here? Oh, oh wait. Uh, I need the extenders, sorry. Yes. That's is what we're talking about. It's, you know... Just a little bit more storage. Who doesn't want that? All right, you're both looking pretty good. Can see back there, but I don't think you'd notice it whilst flying around. And I guess that's it. So let's go ahead and place the med kits back here. Go for the sloops. Okay. Very nice. Alright, is there any other way to get more reverse for us? We could have added another one there. Uh, it just means... Uh, I just don't know. I just don't know if there's a great way to do it. Possibly one underneath. Maybe here. What have we got if we went through, like, the belly here? Right, what's what is there here? Large thruster, kind of straight away. The large thruster's here, though, isn't it? So if we do it here, there's, like, a two-tile gap for one medium thruster. Is that going to make all the difference? No. No, I don't think it is. Maybe we can be cheeky and put one inside. I think we do. We've got plenty of space. So I guess that's what we're going to do. Nope, that's the wrong. There we go. Yeah. Oh, we've got loads. We've got loads in here. Oh, we don't have loads, actually. Uh... Wait a minute. Is there loads of space up here? Oh, wow, there really is. Okay. Okay, what about these shield generators? These additional... There they are. This is where the marmot's really going to set itself apart. I think, can we squeeze one in here? Where, wait, where is this? This is like in the mid, this is the middle right now. Oh, okay, so we've just gone ahead and placed that thruster right in the middle. <laughs> okay, very good. Maybe I did not have as much space as I was, uh, as I was thinking. Uh, as for these, how big is this? Three by two. one of these, no? Yeah, like that. Maybe. <gasps> Place two of them? Yes. Maybe. No. Yes. Place one. One there. Why can't we put one there? There's thrusters there. Mess okay, the inside's a bit of a mess, but I think it's good enough. <laughs> That's here. 86,000. More shields than there were before. 10,000. It's turning into a bit of a fighter, this thing. I'm liking it. <laughs> I'm pretty good for star salvage, if I may say so myself. Alright, auto group. 
tell me about the cargo box. It has 5,375 and I think the ammo as well. Yeah, so they've got like a teeny bit more, which, you know, is a plus. Yeah. Alright, maybe we can do something, it's just looking a little bit iffy here. Line down the middle. Down there. Maybe this here, and then we can probably put a light. I can we can put a light there. Alright. Just something so that uh, maybe like this. Intensity three, range about fifteen meters. We have this space out here as well. I don't know if there's anything I want to put here. I don't think there's anything I want to put there. I think I'm pretty happy. Maybe you'll put like a little light on that. Just a couple of lights for the ground. button. Uh, I'm not even pressing anything right. I've forgotten how to play this. Ah, that's what I'm looking for. Okay. There you go. So, four rail guns, four gats, four rockets, two ions. Do we maybe want to change the colour of these so they're like, you know, stand out a bit more? I think maybe we do. I like the idea of the ions being a slightly different colour. Yeah. All right. There you have it. It's the uh, the marmot. We've managed to spend some more CPU. Let's take a look at the cost of it. If you were to uh, blueprint it in, uh, save as the marmot is over here. Is it the marmot or is it just marmot? I always thought I just had it as marmot. The marmot. I'm going to save as Marmot. Alright. There you go. Just so it's easier to find because if everything's there, then I kind of just get the same problem again and again, don't I? <laughs> right. There you go. 900 substrate, titanium rods, iron. What about the expensive stuff? 650 neodymium. You should be able to find that in Star Salvatore True Thrusters. The big one is, I guess, engineering components. You're going to need to take apart a lot of stuff to get those. Zascosium alloys could be troublesome. You've got these small electronic bridges, eight, and then obviously the globe, globe bug energy glands. So if you do play uh, Star Salvage, make sure to stash those. Remember, they, they expire within like a minute, like pretty much a hot minute. They are gone. So you need to kill those giant bugs and stash those in a fridge for this build so that's something to remember that's a lot of power coils like that is a lot of power coils uh, but I think that is but this is an end game ship that's the thing this is an end game small vessel you can take out a lot of POIs with it I might have to alter this for I think maybe reforged I know I've got the emperor hog which I don't think I'm going to be able to bring anything in here all oh, right, yes, you need, you need devices unlocked, don't you? Yeah. Where's the Emperor Hog? So, all right, you, you, you'll be up here, won't you? Mm, there it is. So you can't because it's got forbidden blocks. So we can't actually bring it in at the moment. Okay. Uh, but this is like my T4 uh, small vessel so far, anyway. And I've got a reforged version of that. Kind of like this is a Star Salvage build, though. Uh, the only thing I wish I could have done is maybe more trust blocks somewhere. Somehow. Could have been good. So uh, it's alright. It's fine as it is. Yeah, there's some on the back here. Yeah, I'm okay with this. It's good enough. 
good enough. Texturing, I don't know about the texturing, it's a bit like. Uh, yeah, no, I'm going to leave it as it is. I think that's fine. So there we go. The Marmot. Now, we've got the Toucan, which I think is already very well optimised. Uh, where is it? Yeah, there's not a lot of CPU to actually play with there. Let's, let's switch it on. It's pretty much a finished build already. Like, I actually really like this. Uh, the only thing is it doesn't have enough ammo. Uh, that is a big problem. So I'm going to need to locate that ammo box and see if I can maybe uh, just give it more ammo. Uh, where is it? Let's see. Show on hard. There it is. Small ammo box. It is here. Uh, that is... That, in fact, we were on it right there. Yeah. Okay. You've got extensions to the side. I don't really know what's a better way to do this because you're in between all the extensions and stuff. Let's go into the core at the moment. There it is. I'm going to better off just making a second ammo box. Can I make a large one? No, I can't. Why not there? Please deactivate shields first. Okay, cool. There's a room for a box there. Room for more? Any more blocks missing? I mean, just du just doubling the ammo there is is nice, rather than it being 500, which I think is what it is. 100. Gee, that's terrible. It's 200, not 500. Boy, that is pretty trash. <laughs> 13,000 there. 31,000 here. Woo! Oi. There we go. This is more like it. Room for loads here. Problem is, is this is all... I just can't put anything other than individual ammo boxes there. And I'm gonna keep it this way. Alright, that's it. I've just got 500 ammo now. Uh, we don't need to do anything else with that. Let's auto-group that back up. We like the thrusters. We like... Its performance all over, I thought, was pretty impressive. It doesn't have many reverse thrusters. It's only got the four. There was something I could do. It would be improve that. But I don't see a particularly good way other than... No, I don't actually see a, a good spot for anything unless we put one underneath here. Very difficult to see. Mm. Not really a good way to do it. Uh, that's fine, though. Let's just give it another little freaking jumps, doesn't it? Like, it's not the best performing thing. It's turning wise and stuff like that. And reverse is, uh... Reverse is definitely... But it just jumps up like a bird. Which it should! That's the idea. Okay, we need to, um... Go to devices, ammo box... There it is. Get rid of that. I mean, I guess that's it, right? The toucan is pretty much ready. So, okay, why, why you no know, save? There we go. The toucan should be down here. If I remember how to spell. There's the dustpan, the marmot, toucan. Yeah, no, I quite like it actually. I like the thrusters here. I kind of like, I think what I've done there is alright actually. Nice uh, orange touch on the top there. The orange black always works. It's always a, a class, classy look. And you've got the marmot here. Alright, nice. Yes, there we go. There's two vessels that I think are particularly good. Shall we see how they convert to regular Imperion or maybe how we can sort of uh, adjust them? to standard Imperion. Maybe we will. So give me one moment and I'll just load up a different creative session or an actual creative session. All right, so here they are in regular Imperion and apparently they're both game shape ready. I don't think this, the two can change at all, but I'm failing to see how those little shield boosters are. Yeah, yeah, look at the CPU difference. They are clearly not ready. I mean, I think it's, t yeah, it's taken away the blocks that are not valid. 
So there's shield boosters and stuff like that. No, no, no. I don't see the Marmot being a thing for regular Imperion. Maybe in... I don't know. Let me see what, what, what options are there. It's just regular shield generators. Given the fact that I've got the Space Hog and the family of, of Hogs, as it were, I don't think I need that. The Toucan, on the other hand, is lovely. Like, it's, it's a T3 hauler, SV hauler, which I think there's use for that, especially if you find a planet that you cannot take a capital vessel down. Like a high-gravity planet, this thing is really good, actually. I think it's really useful. Uh, by the way, this is the Tadpole. This was the version, basically the T2 version of it, as it were. It has 32,000 storage. So this has, what, one that's almost 32, then an extra 13, 14, but also has the extra functionality with the turrets. Um, Gats as well, whereas this only has, like, what, one gat? No, it's got two, actually. Okay, fair enough. Uh, yeah, pretty good. So the Toucan is, yeah, it's a viable solution in both Star Salvage and regular Imperion, which is quite nice. Okay, now I guess we want to see how they fare up in Reforged version of the game. So give me another moment and uh, yeah, I'll load that up. All right, so once again, everything on the Toucan works. However, there's a slight problem here in Reforged. Uh, it's over CPU. So let's take a little look at the CPU logistics. Now remember, the CPU system is very different in Reforged. Uh, you actually don't, there's no tiers, you just get extra CPU for different blocks, different extenders, that is, I should say. And I believe we've only got the two tier three extenders in here, so we can probably add a tier two. And then, so we can get rid of one of these, like, small ammo boxes, I reckon. Uh, if we actually go to core, there is no core, core systems, there is core systems, what am I saying? Improved. What's the maximum number you can have? Two. Okay, let's go CPU extender. Uh, not see, yeah, not what I'm doing there. Oh, here we go. Shield capacitors, shield, these are all stuff I'm going to be uh, using. Possibly the heavy shield generator, I don't know, maybe, maybe. Heavy laser turret, that sounds awesome, but we're not going to have that. Instead, we want to add a basic CPU extender. This gives us an extra 6,000, which will put it within tolerance, so I like that. Let's retrieve this. There we go. And get a load of this. Oh yes, it falls just within it. So this could be used in Reforged as well, just as a CPU, uh, a cargo hauler. Uh, how valid is the shield generator? And the standard shield generator, is that a thing in... Yeah, standard shield generator. What's the CPU? 5,000. What's the heavy duty one we've got here? That's, so that's an extra 3,000. Wait, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, it was an extra 3,000. So it's 3,000, then 5,000, yeah? Sorry, 6,000. Da, 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 da. Nope, uh -uh. we could not afford that. Did I get that right? Company's like, no, you didn't. There's a light shield generator, that is 1250. Heavy, 6,000. And the medium one is 3,000. The capacity is 1,500. Recharge rate, 100. If we were to add these. 1250, 1250, 2500. Do I have that much? I think I've got 1700. I could add one if I had the space. Uh, do you know what? Hang on. Just so I've got a reference point, I cannot spell. Uh, this, right. How big are these? They're two. So what if I got rid of. We, we can get by with two ammo boxes, right? I added that one. So I wouldn't mind increasing capacity. That's more important, I think, in the Toucan. So, 1500 capacity recharge rate 100. If we were to add a, not a charger, but a capacitor, it tanks the recharge rate a bit, but it does add a little bit of capacity. 500. So it'd go to 2000, and that just gives it a little bit more, you know, durability, I think. Which is kind of the point of this thing. It's meant to haul... And yeah, it does. It hauls quite nicely. Uh, oh yeah, we got the wireless and the... Um, forgot we had these on the outside. I <laughs> just sort of slapped them on there. Uh, that's fine. They can stay out there. They shouldn't be getting hit regardless. So yeah. There's no... There's absolutely no room anywhere else. This is complete. It is completely full now. Except for back here, apparently. Can we maybe add the... Hmm... 
Maybe a small ammo box there. Ooh, look at you. Laser turrets. See, I'm not familiar with the turrets in... Do you know what? Let's just go... Turret! Let's get rid of caps lock and look at weapons. Okay. So why are you laser turrets now? CPU 1400, CPU 1000. You'd really just be minigun turrets. Uh, it can be used in both space and atmosphere. What about the laser turrets? It can be used in both. These are damage bonus against alien. These are high damage against energy shields. And this is damage penalty against turrets, devices, and blocks. Bonus damage against troops, wildlife, drones. That's the idea. So I am in fact going to remove. I mean, these are this is all going to be fantastic. Uh, yes, let's go with this and put you there, put you there, very nice, very nice, get that nice orange on the go, and that adds more CPU, we could add another shield thing, how much room is there here, there's just one, so surely you can be, um, yeah, I think you should be a container extension, to be honest with you. You can't. There's two containers there already. Alright, ammo box it is. Hmm. Do the ammo boxes come up as, uh... <laughs> ammo! Huh, okay. Small... Okay, oh. oh okay, Does, are these blocks that don't exist? Oh, oh, oh. That might be... Right, something we're going to have to look at then is... Uh... Yeah. Okay, I was going to say, it doesn't want them as individual blocks, does it? Because if these are, are these something that can be researched? Because if they can't be researched, we can't ever build them. That's the, tr that's the, that's kind of the catch, you see. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. It's the tech tree. Is this the tech tree for Star Salvage? Why is that appearing? That ain't right. Mind you, this is probably a very redundant build um, at this point. This, this, yeah. I think I need to make a new one. Right, I'm going to have to look into that because my problem is that if we can't build those blocks, then we can't actually, like, build this ever. It says we've got small ammo boxes. So I'm going to place that in anyway. I've got all of this ready. Yeah, we'll just leave it as it is. Uh, 1500, we could so build like another one of these, or like another large capacitor. Which I'm tempted to just slap on here. Problem is it needs to be done in a nice, like, tactful way, I suppose. Hmm, I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm going to leave that as it is, so let me save over, uh, save as the token RF for Reforged. Okay, the marmot. Right, here's the marmot. And uh, here is the emperor hog, which has lasers and stuff on it now. It has loads of lasers. It shouldn't have lasers. It should also have miniguns because it's a heavy laser. Okay, what's that do? I'm going to have to come back to all this heavy laser turret. Pew, pew, pew. All right, well... Does that mean you're over CPU? Huh. <laughs> Just a bit. <laughs> yeah, Reforged has changed, I think, and I don't think my builds are up to date. I'm gonna have to take a look at my, oh, start a CV for Reforged that I've had planned to use. I li like it, it's it's a weird looking thing, the Beluga Explorer. Anyway, what's going on here? Not a lot, not a lot indeed. So let's manage your fuel and go ahead and top this up. All right, there'll be more gaps in here. No doubt, yep, there are. As you're missing various things. You must have a standard shield generator, right? Where is it? Where's that shield generator? Because you do not need that one, that one anymore. Whatever it is, wherever it is. 
where actually is it? Isn't it like out here somewhere? Hmm. You only feel like you're looking right at it. I can't see it. Isn't it down or is it down here? Is it underneath? Okay, CPU statistics. I don't think it has one. Yeah, no, it doesn't. There is no standard shield generator, apparently. So what did you have? Just double check that it's not appearing here, right? I don't see anything for shields. If we go to generator, it's just regular generators. Go to equipment, it's just the wireless. Okay, well, I'll take your word for it. Bung that in here. We'll go ahead and add, uh, I got, I got a bunch of stuff we can add in here. So with these, we kind of want to do it on a 2-1 scale, right? Well, we kind of want the recharge rate to be quick. So I've gone ahead and added that. And this is the charger or extender or something. That's the charger, yeah. So what's it? Two charges. Negates the, yeah, pretty much. So we'll go ahead and add a charger there. Capacitor. Can we add another charger? Do we have, do we have the, uh... No, not quite. Wait, wait. No, not quite. No, no. Oh wait, one there. And one there. Alright. Now we need to find CPU extenders as well. That's, uh... I think this has... Like, what CPU extenders does it have? Should be under core systems. It has CPU advanced. We can have five of those, which we, I do indeed intend on using. So if we go CPU, extend or one advanced, two improved. Uh, I'm going to want to use these. You, you've already used the heavy duty one, didn't you? Yeah, we did. Who am I talking to? You, of course. You listening. Just sound, sometimes I realise like I must sound like a mad person. <laughs> Let's go with that. That can go squeeze in here. Right, how are we looking so far? Oh, very close. This this one last thing will do it. Uh, but I don't like the fact that it's blocking a thruster. Like, that's just sort of never feels right doing that. Uh, but this is okay. Suddenly, it's compliant. Unguided missiles, Type A lasers, railgun projectile. Okay, so there is a way to make this work for Reforged. I'm going to have to dive into Reforged again. And as you can see here, it's, it's the same story. We actually have more CPU spare. Uh, a little bit, which we could probably add on more turrets. We've already upped the shields by a good bit. Wouldn't mind seeing if we can do that some more. Because that's not a whole lot of shields, but I don't quite know how the values work. Hmm. That's for you. You should not have... You should have gats. Gats all around. That was always the plan. I'm pretty sure of it. And then you have that weird blue colour, right? This one, yeah. Cool. I do like this Emperor. I think I did alright with this one. All the rockets. Heavy lasers. So you absolutely wreck. Actually, what does the heavy laser even do? Is it... Heavy laser can high damage versus shields. You get rid of the shields. Smack them with the rockets. Or the rail guns. The rail guns are kind of there as a backup, to be honest. You're, not gonna, you're gonna have trouble aiming from there. Because they're kind of above. It always ended up being a bit weird. Uh, but yeah, we never really had one more little fly around of the marmot, did we? Uh, it seems to be okay. Might want to add a bit more texturing to it. It's a little bit plain. Whoa. Does alright for those two thrusters, doesn't it? Do you know what, though? We can get this working in Reforged. Using this with the starter CV. Could be quite good, couldn't it? Um, 
Is this unfinished? I think this is an unfinished variant of it. In fact, this is definitely an unfinished variant of it. Yeah, no. <laughs> Where's the finished one? The Beluga Voyager. There it is. Uh, a bunch of templates from the workshop. Here we go. Open up. There we go. And look on the side. It says Beluga Voyager. Yeah. Alright, kind of got to come in at a weird angle. There you go. Hey, the marmot would do quite well in here. In the belly of the whale. Yeah. Up you come, you've got this, you've got your quorum. You've got your, your cockpit up here, and down here is where you jump into the small vessel, the rocky roider to mine asteroids. But you're doing a lot of the fighting in in this. In fact, you could park it up here and have a hover vessel in there. Oh man, I'm starting to get my reforged sort of playthrough ready here. What I need to do now is get a good hover vessel. Perhaps, I don't know what sort of thing I could do. I don't need a miner, do I? Because I've got the Rocky Roider. Hmm. That might be a future video because I do want to do a playthrough of Reforged. That is, that is the plan at some point. I've just been waiting so it's more and more complete as it were. That is something I've been uh, doing. Oh, I forgot about you. The Orion, I was going to call this. Yes, that's the front part of a giant combat capital vessel. <laughs> giant, as you can clearly see. Uh, yeah. Uh, what's the CPU on this thing? Over. By a bit, actually. Hmm. Something else to look at another time. All right, well, there we go. I'm going to leave it there for now. So I hope you like that. We've got the Mama which we have made ready for uh, all modes, I suppose. I mean, there's no point. I think, you know, it's ready for Star Salvage. And I would say we can get a version here, as you can see, ready for Reforged. So actually, if we go the Marmot, we go Save. That's not the thing I'm looking for. There's a different Marmot. Marmot number two, please. Uh, these, what am, I, what am I doing? What's running me? Have I forgotten the alphabet? I think I have. Oh yeah, it's up here, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Stupid, stupid me. Save as. Marmot RF for Reforged. There you go. Yeah, not bad. All right, well, anyway. Next time I might be starting a new scenario that's just like a small, quick one. Um, it's, I think it's a very old one, I believe. Possibly, so I'm not really too sure. Next time's going to be a surprise. I'm going to see how I feel and how I get on, so we'll go from there. One thing I want to do as well, these teeth are kind of overhanging. I kind of want to... I'm going to need to put a block in <laughs> there as well. Yeah, all right. I'm going to leave it there for now. So thank you so much for watching, everybody, and I'll see you all next time.